Good morning. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. First of all, I would like to thank to the organizing committee for letting me to present my research with the title of Response of Artemisia Anua Accession to Nitrogen Fertilizer on Low Altitude. The background of this research is malaria, a kind of communicable disease that still uh, to be the health problem in Indonesia, especially in the eastern provinces of Indonesia. The medication should be complied to WHO standard using ACT or artemisinin combination therapy. Artemisinin combination treatment was chosen to, to increase the effectiveness of malaria treatment that is already resistant to chloroquine. Artemisinin uh, was still imported from China and Indi India, even though Artemisia annua, the plant as a main source of artemisinin, could be cultivated in Indonesia. Artemisia annua is a a plant that native to China and it is a subtropical plant that belong to Astraceae family. It was a short deep plant uh, which tend to initiate flowering fast faster when it is cultivated in the tropical region. The previous research stated that faster flowering of Artemisia annua will reduce leaf production as well as the artemisinin content. Nitrogen could be used to increase the vegetative growth. We know that uh, application of nitrogen fertilizer for several kinds of horticulture plants could stimulate the growing of the vegetative part. So it is necessary to treat uh, the Artemisia annua with nitrogen fertilizer in order to prolong the flowering period. The objective of the research is to evaluate the growth and artemisinin as well as the volatile oil levels of three accession of artemisia annua treated by three doses levels of nitrogen fertilizer in lowland. The research has been carried out using randomized complete block design with nitrogen fertilizer as main factor which applied to three accession of Artemisia annua. This research was conducted on May to December 2017 in the research garden and phytochemistry laboratory of Medicine of Plant and Traditional Medicine Research and Development Center. The parameter involves of grow and yield parameters as follows, one high stem diameter, number of branches for growth parameters and fresh leaves and dry leaves for yield parameter also artemisinin and volatile oil levels this is the uh, three accessions of artemisia annua using in this experiment namely accession one or v1 Accession 2, uh, V2, and Accession 3, or V3. Accession 1 characterized by the crown shape of leaves with the color of light green. The Accession 2 characterized by the compact uh, leaf shape. And Accession 3 with uh, irregular irregular compact leaves with the color of dark green. This is the morphological characters of Artemisia annua accessions. The accession 1 or V1 characterized with a high crew more than 2 meters and uh, the, branch, the branch is not too tight. Accession 2 characterized with dense leaves and tight branching and Accession 3 with median growth not more than 2 meters high with the slight 
friend say. The result of the research showed that nitrogen application was affected significantly to all crop parameters except the stem diameter. The nitrogen dosage level application was affected to the plant height and the number of branches. This increasing of nitrogen dosage level was tend to increase the plant height as well as the number of branches. It is known that nitrogen could stimulate the vegetative growth of plants, indicating by the increasing of plant height and also the number of branches. This is the picture which a figure of the nitrogen application uh, effect to the leaf yield of the accession of Artemisia annua. From the figure, it is shown that nitrogen dosage levels was affect to the yield of leaves weight, both fresh and dry leaf weight of the accession of Artemisia annua. It is interesting that accession 2 and accession 3 namely V2 and V3 was not responsive to nitrogen dosage application since the increasing of nitrogen dosage level was decreasing the leaf yield both dry and fresh leaf yield of Artemisia annua. This figure was described the effect of nitrogen dosage level to the artemisinin and volatile oil content of the accession of Artemisia annua. It was shown that the increasing dosage of nitrogen was tend to increase the volatile oil contents of accession 1, but it did not occur to accession 2 and accession 3. The result is same to the artemisinin in content parameters. The increasing of dosage level of nitrogen tend to increase the artemisinin's content also. Overall, the highest level of artemisinin content was obtained in accession 1 with the 3 kilo, 300 kg of nitrogen application. From the research, it could be concluded that the type of accession does not produce stable production and artemisinin in level and it was tend to increase with increasing nitrogen doses. Accession 3 or V3 produce better crop performance than V1 and V2. The increasing doses of nitrogen fertilizer tend to increase the artemisinin in level in all accessions. The best crop productivity includes the interaction of biomass production and artemisinin level produced by accession 1 with nitrogen doses of 300 kg per hectare. That's all my presentation and thank you for your kind attention.